Okay. Uh, good morning, everyone. Good morning, guys. Good morning. Good morning, teacher. Uh, okay, let me check who's online and who's on site as well. Right. And let's start the class, start the lesson. Uh, Fuji. Okay. Uh, Fang Pong. Okay. Pong. Jom Jam. Uh, percent. Okay, Kai Mok. Okay, Kai Mok. Uh, BM. No, right? Uh, C. Yeah, Prao. Garto. No. Nikki. Nikki. No. Archie. Archie here. Uh, Timmy. Okay. Armus. Mina. Payson. Okay. Uh, Granda. Presentation. Next. Facing. Mm -hmm. Good. Kim. Kaupan. Uh, Tata. Okay. Tata is here. Uh, Sunshine. Sprite. Narnia. May May. Or oh, I'm sorry, Mimi. Okay. Mimi. Uh Pei Pei. All right. Pei Pei is here. Mo. Uh Q. Uh me. Me? No, right? Okay, guys. Uh, nice to see all of you. Uh, as I already informed you, so today we're going to to read a lot. So just get ready your your books, please. Uh, page number seventy eight. Page number seventy eight. Uh, we got uh, that is chapter which is called Asian Honor. So we will learn something new about. Asian countries, right? Now, let me share my screen first. You can open your books, page number 78. Here we are. Can you see my screen? Yeah, page number 78. Uh, this, uh, how would Topic today is sustain, uh, sustainability for the future. So before we'll start to, this, to read, I would like you to go through the new vocabulary. New vocabulary, yes. Teacher? Yes? Number 76. Yes, yes, Kopan, 76. The time action. No, no. Oh, I'm so. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. Seventy-eight. Um, confused. Seventy-eight. Got it. seventy-eight. Page number seventy-eight. This one. This topic. Yeah. Page number seventy-eight. All right. Uh, what does it mean? Sustain. Sustain. It means make something continue to exist or happen for a period of time. Uh, how will you say in Thai? Sustain. Huh? Guys, could you read in Thai? How do you say? All right. Ability. Ability, it means the state of being able to do something. Uh, in Thai, Granda, could you read in Thai? Ability. Granda, can you hear me? 
Yes. Okay. How do you say ability in Thai? Oh, good. Could you, could you say it loud so your friends can hear? All right. So we have two words we combine now together. Okay, sustain and ability. So we combine them together and get another word, which is sustainability. It means the ability to continue or be continued for a long time. How do you say that in Thai? Rhonda, I need your assistance. Could you read all these Thai words, okay? All right. Next word, observe. To protect something and to prevent it from changing or being damaged. Aim. To try or intend to achieve something. Pest, an insect or an animal that destroys plants, food, and etc. All right. Unique, being the only one of its kind. Uh, theory, the principles on which a particular subject is based. Uh, divide, uh, separate, or make something separate into parts. Bang. Pond, a small area of fresh water, especially uh, one that is artificial. Banana. Okay. Uh, paddy, a field in which rice is grown. How? Fertilizer. I, I know uh, this body fertilizer is from science. I think it's starting from grade three, right? You get it all this. Already this works. Uh, fertilizer is substance added to soil to make plants grow more successfully. Oui. Mm -hmm. And factor, one of several things that cause or influence something. Okay, so before uh, we'll start reading, we need all these words, right? So uh, if you want to mark, you can write down, okay, translation. It's okay? Yeah? All right. So uh, let's come and let's, let's read the text. Uh, who can... Who can start reading? Let me ask you guys. Uh, we will go by. Um, we will divide the topic into four parts. Okay, so who's gonna start? Huh? Okay, Jam Jam. Uh, Jam Jam, yes. right? could you start, please? Okay, sure. Uh, do you love gardening and farming? If yes, you can you can your make your garden and farm sustainable. Sustainable garden gardening or farming is to do gardening or farming that has the least negative effect on the environment so people can in the future can still live on it. Uh -huh. Very good. Very good. Uh, Granda, let's read the next one. Yes. Got it? I think the same is to. Gardens by the bay? Yes. Uh, okay. Um, let me ask Jum Jum, Jum Jum, because your microphone is quite good. Could we ask you yeah. to read it, please? <laughs> yeah, we can hear you well. Yeah. I use laptop. <laughs> I. <laughs> okay. Gardens. Gardens. Gardens by the bay in Singapore 
Singapore is a good example. It is a nature park which is known for its excellent management system on water and electricity. The, the goals of this park to con, are to conserve plants and to limit water use by cleansing and reusing it. The park, the park also aims uh, to reduce the amount of electricity by using solar energy. The flowers are the flowers here are nat natural pest controllers. So there are the, so there is no need to use chemical chemicals to kill pests. Gardens by the bay also improve Singapore economy and tourism as well. With the with is Unique, well, unique, unique, unique design, unique design and variety of plants. The park is the one is okay. one of the top tourist spots in Singapore. Bar, bus, locals and tourists love to come here. <laughs> in Thailand, in Thailand, there is a theory called New Theory Agriculture. Culture. The theory was introduced by His Majesty King Kumipon. It suggests that people divide the la their land to, into different parts. There, there should be a pond to supply plant and, plants and animals. The land also includes rice paddies with vegetables and seasonal fruit. There, there should be a small area for animals and a place for making natural fertilizer as well. By following this plan, people will have, to, will have enough food to eat all year round. They can also sell them to earn money and earn money. This helps promote income within, within uh, fam the family mo moreover, uh, natural fertilizer uh, also good for the environment. <laughs> I know you're the concept. Let's finish. Yes. <laughs> the concept of sustainable gardening and farming not only save our environment, but also help help in promote economic stability, which are. Uh, <laughs> the key factors to sustain sustainability in the future. Okay, sustainability in the future. Thank you, thank you, Jam Jam. Okay, guys, what do we understand from this topic? Could you give me some things? What do you understand? What is like, what you pay attention for? Huh? Why do we call Susta uh, sustainability for the future. Why do we call this topic like this? This article. Huh? Huh? Guys, give me your suggestions. Give me your ideas. Why do we call this topic uh, sustainability for the future? Sustainability, it's like we can keep it for long. Even we can, with this, what we create now, it will stay for a long time. Even like we can say, even we die, right? But this, what we created will stay and will serve for our next generations, right? So why? And what, what was the idea of it? Huh? <laughs> Uh, I'm sorry, I can't hear. Okay, so people want to grow the plants, right? Okay, and what's the idea? Hmm? You know, 
when we create something, right? It's easy to uh, it's easy to build, but the most difficult thing is to to keep it for long. You know, to uh, to support that is the most different part. We can we can build something, but to keep it for long that's very very difficult. And people they invent something, right? So how can we do it for long? How can we do gardening for long? How how people can survive even without, let's say, uh, they can survive on farming because uh, soil it has its own resource as well, right? So we can plant we can plant only for like two three years, and then this soil has to relax for another like maybe one or two years. We cannot touch it, but the people invented, how can we, how can we do it continuously, continuously? And what do we need for that, right? For that kind of gardening. That? Oh, okay. Let me add it. So we are talking now about which country? Could you tell me? Huh? We are talking about Singapore. What is there in Singapore? I'm sorry? Gardens by the Bay, right? Gardens by the Bay. Okay. Is it famous place? And why? Why it's famous place? Uh -huh, guys, what, what what is gardens by the bay actually? What is that? Yeah, it's a nature park. Very good. Uh, why it's famous? Why it's so famous? It has excellent, it has excellent management system on water and electricity, right? Yes, Q. Huh? Yes, man. Are you call guys? Huh? Oh, it's called? Can off it. You can off. Yeah, it's very it's very cold actually. Yeah. Could 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 it switch off? Yeah. Okay, good. So now I can hear you as well, right? <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. So we said we said Garden by the Bay in Singapore is a famous place. Why? Why it's famous place? Find find the answers. Find the answers in, in the text. Hmm? It has excellent management of what? Very good. So it has management. Uh, it has excellent management uh, management system on water and electricity. Uh, what are the goals? Huh? To conserve plants and and to limit cleansing and you reusing it. So it means uh, this water can be reused, right? So we can conserve plants. Uh, we can also produce electricity, right? So uh, also we can reuse same water, right? 
It's like water circle. We can use it inside. We don't need anything from outside. Okay. Uh, what else? What can we say about past? You remember what what is what is past? What is past? Insect, correct. So how can we how can they manage the past? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Uh huh. The flowers, okay. The flowers here. So there is no need. Yeah, yeah, could you continue? So there is no need to use. Yeah, so no need to use chemicals to kill the past, to kill past. So actually flowers, flowers itself, right? They are good pest controllers. Uh-huh, what can we also say about this? Uh, do this, uh, do this, gar uh, do this gardens, um, influence on Singapore's economic? Huh? Tourists, right? Say so they attract, these gardens attract tourists, right? Okay. Okay. Uh, let's talk about Thailand. Uh, there is one theory, right? There is one theory, uh, which is called new theory agriculture. What is what is this kind of theory? What is based on? Hmm? Who introduced this theory? Huh? Yeah, who introduced the theory? Uh, Jom Jom, could you assist? Uh, Ramanai. Okay, okay. And what uh what what is what is this the theory? What is based on? New theory agriculture. Uh -huh. yeah. Huh? New theory agriculture. Yeah. What is that? Uh, it's a it's a suggest it's suggest. Dividing the land to different parts. Uh -huh. So it means we have a land, right? You have your house, for example. You have a land. And what do we do? We divide into different parts, right? Like what? Let's look at the picture. What they should be? Blue color, what is that? They should be pond. Right? There should be a pond to supply plants and animals, right? Pond. Pond is like can supply plants and animals like fish. So if you have pond, you can you can uh, cultivate, you can grow the fish and you can take it in it. Am I right? Yeah, that's a very, very smart idea. Okay, what else? What else? What do we have as well on the plant? Huh? Yeah, this land also includes rice paddies, right? This one. So rice paddies. Why? Why? We can cultivate rice, yes? We can grow, we can cultivate rice and we can eat it. Eat and sell even. What else? What else? Uh, what other things are there? Uh-huh. What other things are there? A part of uh, rice patties. Yes, vegetables 
and seasonal fruits. Mm -hmm. What other things do we have on that land? There should be a small area for animals and place for making natural fertilizers as well. Uh, what is that place for making natural fertilizers? What is fertilizers? What is that? What is fertilizer? Huh? That is from science, guys. That is from science. What is fertilizer? No, it's not animal. Fertilizers is some kind of food for plant, you know? It's like a kind of food. So plant can grow fast. Uh, that is called like compost. Maybe you heard about it, like compost. Uh, that's like when you, uh, if you have some kind of leftovers, right? Some uh, vegetables, you just throw it. Usually what we do, we throw it into the bin, right? Into the garbage. But if you have a land, what you can do? You can assign a, a small piece of land. You make a hole, right? You make a hole and you start putting some leftovers like apples, uh, some like kind of bananas or some, uh, some leaves, okay? So you don't throw it, but you keep it. And after some time, you know, there are lots of worms inside. inside. So they fertilize, they, uh, they destroy all that, um, uh, they destroy all leftovers and they make uh, some kind of um, soil in a while, okay? It becomes a soil. So this soil can be used uh, to, to put on, um, to plant, okay? To, to, to grow on other plants. So it's used as a fertilizer. All right. Uh, what else? Okay, let's summarize, right? Let's summarize. Uh, regarding Thailand, King, uh, King Rama, Rama 9, right? King Rama 9. So he suggests to make uh, a new theory agriculture, right? So what do we do? Let's summarize. What do we do? We have a piece of land. What, how, should we, how should we manage this piece of land? What do we do? Number one, we make a pond, right? So we can grow new plants and also we can have what inside? Fish or maybe shrimps, right? Fish, shrimps, okay. Number two. Because land is big, so. Huh? Rice bodies, okay. What else? Rice bodies. What about this? Vegetables, uh, different kind of fruit, right? Vegetables and different kind of fruit we can cultivate as well. All right. We can have, see, some pigs, right? We can have a farm. We can have a farm as well, right? And we can produce fertilizers because we have lots of leftovers and we have lots of plants, so we can make fertilizers. That's why family who lives on the farm, you only take care of your farm. You have enough money to, uh, you have enough food all over the year, right? And also you can sell, you can sell your products. Maybe you can sell like chicken eggs, you can sell meat, right pork meat you can sell like different kind of things vegetables fruit and so on 
All right. So now uh, let's answer some questions. Read the text and mark the sentences, true or false. Let's do it, guys. Q, go ahead. Let's read first sentence. Mm -hmm. All right. True or false? Flowers in gardens by the bay are natural pest controllers. What do you think? You don't know? Huh? Wrong. False? False, right? How do you know? Let's let's find the answer. The answer is here. Let's read. Q. So there is no need to kill pests. 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 Who, who are the pests? What is that? Pests. Huh? Pests is insects. Like, yeah, it's like, um, Pests like you know cockroach, yeah, some yeah. kind of so the pests which destroy destroy the plants they destroy the plants, but the flowers in the gardens by the bay they control themselves they control the, themselves that pests. All right, so what can we say? Flowers in garden the bay are natural pest controllers. It's true or false? That is true. That is true, guys. Write down. That is true. Okay. Uh, who is next? Uh, Nest. Nest, could you read number two, please? Nest. Garden by the they use a lot of water and electricity. Uh -huh. Gardens by the bay uses a lot of water and electricity. Is it true or false? Wow. Hmm? False, right? Why? Why is false? They don't use a lot, right? But why? Let me go back. Why? Gardens by the bay uses a lot of water and electricity. Hmm? Where is the answer? Uh -huh, solar energy. Okay. Uh, it's here. Let's read. The goals of and we're using it. This is the answer, right? That is a support for your uh for your answer, right? Okay, so uh, you are right. So gardens by the bay uses a lot of water and electricity. It's false because no, it has a very good management, right? It's very excellent. We can say management system that allows to conserve everything inside, right? And not to use uh, energy and water from outside. Okay. Uh, number three. Timmy, go ahead. Number three, the new theory agriculture. The new theory agriculture aims to make people rich. Is it true or false? Huh? 
false. Why? Why it's false? Mm -hmm. Yeah, prepay. Why it's false? Huh? No, not to reduce for electricity. The question is, the question is, right, the, the new theory agriculture aims to make people rich. Can people be rich if they use that uh, system? Huh? Actually, actually, uh, that is that is false. Why? You have a piece of land, right? You have a pond. You have uh, rice paddies. You have fruits and vegetables. You have a farm. Can you be rich? Yes, very good. It's just made that. Uh, because King, he taught about his people, right? His nation. And he said, okay, let's first of all organize so people will not uh, suffer, right? So they will have enough of food. Yeah, that was the main concept to have the new um, theory agriculture. Uh, it doesn't say that people will become rich if they're, if they're practicing this kind of, right? agriculture theory all right and let's go to the next question number four uh -huh. the new theory agriculture helps people to rely on themselves hmm? true right or not true you're right, it's true. So if you don't work on your land, you will not get the food, right? But if you cultivate things, you cultivate rice, you cultivate vegetables, you cultivate fruit, so you, you just rely on yourself, you rely on your family members, right? So you produce for yourself. If you do not work, you will not get it. But you can, you can uh, support yourself. All right, and the last one, sustainable gardening or farming is good for the environment and economy. Hmm? True, right? Yes, that is true. It's true that sustainable gardening or farming is good for the environmental and, oh, uh, sorry, for, for the environment and economy. That is true, guys. Or, okay, I know it's not easy to read, I know it's not easy to read, but uh, when you have this kind of text, you have to extract the most important information from the text. You need to, first of all, you need to understand the main concept, right? So uh, this text was, uh, it it's consists of two parts, right? First part, we talk about Singapore and second part, we talk about Thailand. So we are comparing these two, uh, two different types of, uh, gardening, we can say, right? Uh, and it's totally different. Okay, uh, I think, guys, our time is uh, our time is up, right? Online can be disconnected any moment. Uh, 